Okay. Okay, here we are uh, in my backyard and we just finished this 260 electric locomotive. I'm going to show you how to turn it on. When you come over here, get closer, and you look under here, and here's the main switch. The light comes on. This top switch over here turns on the electric for the box. The second switch turns on the compressor. You hear the compressor buzzing? Give it a second, it'll pump up the air. And then this last one turns on the amplifier for the noise. That's the sound, that's the sound of the locomotive uh, amplifier sound system from Phoenix. Okay, now I'm going to show you the battery. Slide this off. And then this lifts off like this. And there's a six, six volt batteries. Here's the main fuse. It's a 50 amp fuse. And it's all in series for 36 volts. This fits down in here. This fits in here. And this is the control that you hold in your hands, like this. This is forward, reverse. This is the bell. Hear the bell? This is the whistle. This red light shows you have 12 volt power here. This is the headlight, off, on. This is the volume control, louder, lower. This is the brake. As you put the brake on, you can see the gauge go up for more and more pressure. And this is the speed control to make it go faster or slower. This switch right here, I call a dead switch. When this turned off, you're not going to go anywhere. Here's the speed control, nothing happens. You turn this on, now watch, the locomotive will go. If you turn this off, it'll stop. Okay? When you turn it back on, you have to turn the speed down and then back up again. Now, I'm going to make it go in reverse, and I'm going to explain this. This key fob right here has got two buttons, number one, number two. Number two is a noise maker. It comes out of the box right here. That's to signal the engineer from the conductor in the back of the train. This distance is good for about 200 feet. Number one button will stop the train. I'll demonstrate by backing it up. That's on. Train is going all by itself. And I hit number one, it'll stop. It'll stop. Number two is that noise. Now, in order to make this go again, turn the speed down. Back up again. Going by itself, you hit number one, shuts off. That's good for runaways, for stopping it. I'm going to get on it and go out and we'll talk more when we get out the gate. on the side of it and you can see the rods move. Oh. Triple.